Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so we just got back from Costco a little while ago. Um, my husband and I went with the baby um, while the boys were in summer school and then we had to go pick them up. So our car was pretty packed. We spent 910 or $15 somewhere, 900 something, um, low 900s. But um, yeah, I'm gonna edit the prices in because it is over 60 something items. So I'm just going to edit the price in, or it's like 60, yeah. So I'm going to edit the price in, and um, just to make it easier, because a lot of things are on sale, and I want to make sure you guys get the accurate price, and I don't mess anything up. Um, but I'm going to show you the dry first, and then I'll show you the frozen and dairy in the kitchen. But I might go back tomorrow, because they're out of a few items. I might go back in the morning, and if I do, I'll add that in at the end. But as of right now, this is what we have. And it, again, it's like 900 something, like 915, I think, and some change. So, okay. So, uh, we got this for my husband actually for a late Father's Day present. Um, we, he actually really wanted this for Father's Day, and we just didn't find one online or anything that he liked. But we did see this today, and um, it was a really good price, um, I guess, for what you're getting. But um, it was really comfortable. They had one on display, and they had a couple different types of chairs. But this one was by far, like, the most comfortable and sturdy. So we did get that. Uh, we did get um, body armor. This was on sale. You get seven strawberry banana, uh, seven orange mango, and six fruit punch. I love the fruit punch, so we'll see if we like the other two. But it was a really good deal. And then we got three things of water. It is hot, obviously, for most people right now. Um, we are in California, so it's been pretty hot. And everyone was buying water, so. Um, we'll just go back here. We got um, bounty paper towels. Um, you get 12 rolls in here. And um, they were out of Kirkland paper towels. Otherwise, I'd get them because I saved like 5 or $6. But we did go ahead and get those because I needed them. We did get... Um, the infamous towels that are on sale right now, um, the Charisma towels, um, they're luxury bath towels, and the size, I think the size is on here, sorry guys, about the glare from my light, 30 by 58. So they're pretty decent sized towels. We got this like nice taupey, very soft muted, like purple gray almost. It's more like a brownish, like a very muted brown, like light purple, I guess. Um, almost like a taupe. But anyways, uh, we got four of those because they're really such a killer deal. And then we got the hand towels. and Or there's two hand towels and two washcloths. And that was on sale as well. So we went ahead and got those. Um, we got the Dave's Killer Bread. I don't know if you guys know, but they just started carrying the Thin Slice. I absolutely love the uh, Thin Slice. It's my favorite. It's only 80 calories per slice. I just love this bread. And the boys will eat it. Um, they ate the last one, so that was good. So this is perfect for lunches and all that. And it's a great size. So we got a pack of those, and there's two in there. That to the side. We got another two-pack of the... The country um, French loaves. And there's the price for that. Um, it was so good. We really enjoyed that the last time we got it. And it lasted us a few days and we use it for a few different things. And just a snack on. Um, we did see these hoodies. Organic honey roasted cashews. So my husband grabbed those and put those in the cart and they look really good. Um, so there's that. We got um, cashew clusters. Um, we haven't had these for a while, but we love these. So we saw them and grabbed those. And not the best, but a little bit better of a snack than some other things we could have grabbed. This one's with almonds and pumpkin seeds. It's really good, you guys. Um, we did get some Lindor. They actually were... Um, I took a little clip of it. They actually were um, doing samples again. So that's a very exciting thing. Um, finally getting back to some sort of normalcy and it was really nice to see Costco having samples out again um, We got a Lindor truffle. They had these out and then we went ahead and grabbed the bag and they also the other thing we tried They had other stands, but the other thing we tried 
for our one-year-old, we got, like, these baked beans. They're actually really good, but we have some. Um, they were, like, more fresh and came in a container in the deli area. But um, they were heating those up in a little tiny sample cup, and she loved that. So she ate that all up and got it all over the place. <laughs> so there's that. We got a chicken. Same thing as usual. We love the chickens. They're great just to eat on their own or with bread. Um, and easy for like recipes. Love the chicken. Um, these are new for us to try. I've seen them in a couple hauls before. Um, they're the pure organic layered fruit bars. I'm pretty sure my boys will like these. They like the ones from Trader Joe's that are like more like the thin leathers. Um, but I think they'll like them. I've heard good things. So I got those for like their lunches and snacks. There's eight pineapple passion fruit. 12 strawberry banana and 8 raspberry lemonade. That one sounds really good. So um, I will let you know, but I'm hoping they will like those. We got more of the Kirkland Signature, or more of. We haven't gotten these in a while, actually. Um, the Kettle Brand Crinkle Cut Himalayan Salt Potato Chips. That was a mouthful. <laughs> these are really good, you guys. Um, a little bit harder of a chip, so it depends on your preference, but these are really tasty. Uh, we got these Cliff Bars. There's 24 in there. 12 white chocolate macadamia nut. That's our absolute favorite. My husband and I love those. And then 12 chocolate chip, which I think the boys will really like for a snack at school, like at their summer school they're going to. So we got those. Uh, we did get a two-pack of the Honey Nut Cheerios. Um, so there's that. It's a two box for, let's see if it says, so it's two pounds. So there's that. We got the Choco Rooms again, 24 bags. We love these. Every once in a while we get them for our boys for the snack bin. So there's that. Um, let's see. I might as well just show you because it keeps falling down. Um, I did get this. It's kind of silly, I know, but um, I wanted to give it a try to clean my brushes, so we'll see. It's a Style Pro makeup brush, cleaner and dryer. I've seen it a couple times when I've been in there, and I've kind of eyed it, but this time there's only a few left, and I'm wondering if they're not gonna carry it anymore once it sells out. So I did go ahead and get that. I'll let you know if I do try it, or if not, I might take it back, but we'll see. So there's that. We got, um, here, I'll go this way. We got Honest Kids Organic um, Juice Boxes. So there's 16 Super Fruit Punch, 8 Apple Ever After, and 8 Berry Good Lemonade, and 8 Goodness Grapeness. So we went ahead and got these. We'll see. I'm hoping my 6-year-old will kind of like them. Um, the last time we tried them, they weren't, you know, because they are a little bit a lot better than most of the juice boxes and um, they're a little more watered down so hopefully he likes them for his little snack lunches for summer school and then going into back to school if he does we'll get more but if not I know at least um, every once in a while like on the go my one-year-old she will like these and maybe my older son even so we're gonna give these a shot and see how we like them I did get some flowers um, these are sunflowers um, they're really pretty. I'm just ready for fall, guys. I can't wait. It's, like, super hot right now and in, in the middle of summer, but I'm really excited. Um, obviously, 4th of July is this weekend, so um, I stuck the little flag in there. The lady said, the, the florist that was working there, she said I could. This was in, like, a red, white, and blue bouquet that I almost got, and then, um, but I really wanted the sunflowers, and she's like, you can put that flag in there. So I went ahead and did that. And so, yeah, so there's that. Um, we did need more the dish pods um, for our dishwasher. This is the Kirkland Signature, the Ultra Shine. Never had an issue with them. We really like these. And there's 115 in there. So we went ahead and got those. Uh, we got, this was a great deal. This is $10 off, this Nexus shampoo and conditioner pack so we got those it's a 24 hour moisture um so like i said just a great deal so we went ahead and we needed some 
Um, I did get these. This pack was a great deal for the Method Anti-Bac um, All-Purpose Cleaner. I definitely needed some antibacterial, so I was glad to see that, and I got that. Uh, for my husband, and then my son, my older son, can use this as well. These were on sale. It's a five-pack of the Degree Men um, deodorant, 48-hour protection. And this is ultra clear black and white, it says. It smells pretty good, too. I scratched it in the store. It's very clean, but strong, like a good, strong deodorant scent. And um, anyways, like I said, a really good deal. I almost got some for myself as well. Um, they had, was it Dove? I think it was Dove. But I almost got some for myself, but I still have some right now. So once I um, use that up, if this is still on sale, I will grab the four pack of Dove for myself. Uh, we did get a big thing of 7-Up. It's a 36 pack. So we got that to have on hand. Um, and then we also got the Dixie plates that are on sale. This will last us, there's 186 plates in there. This will last us a long time. And we like how thick they are and they work well. It is what it is, it works out for our family. Uh, we got these Swiffer dusters. We have like the long stick and I think it comes with the one to do like the high ceilings. And this one comes with like the little, the short one to do shelves and stuff. So like that. So I went ahead and picked those up because it was a good price for how many you get. You get 28 in there. Uh, we got some Tide Pods. We're almost out. These weren't on sale, unfortunately. Tide is on sale, like the regular detergent. But um, we like we prefer the pods. It's just easier. This one has is the 4-in-1 uh, built-in pre-treaters with ox, um, Ultra Oxy. So we got a big thing of that. And I think there is 104 in there. 104. Okay, we got these, sorry guys, um, we got these Bob books, sorry about the glare, we got these Bob books for um, my kindergartner who's in summer school right now and he's going into first grade um, just to work on his sight words this summer and to make sure he's ready to go because reading gets a little more, um, like it's a little more aggressive in first grade and I want to make sure he's comfortable and knows all of his words and is confident when reading because he'll start writing and all that good stuff. So writing like paragraphs and stuff. So we went ahead and got that and I thought that was a great price. There was some, there was a lot of things I liked in the book section, but I try to uh, control myself a little bit, you guys, and not get everything. Um, my husband picked this out. This is on sale. This is the Cetaphil. This is a bunch of different size lotions i think you get two of the big one and then a four ounce on the go which he said it'll take to work um, but yeah instant hydration with vitamin e and b5 for everyday use um, this is supposedly really good we have been using the CeraVe, but um, this was on sale so we got that and then the dove bar soap my husband has to have bar soap it's just one of those things and this was on sale, so we went ahead and picked it up because bar soap can get pretty pricey. Uh, we got Benadryl. Um, my boys do have like allergies pretty badly, and my middle son's been having a hard time. We can't get him to take the pill form. He just struggles with it because he is six. So we did get um, the children's Benadryl allergy. And um, I'm pretty sure, does it say it on there? This is non-drowsy, I'm pretty sure. And it's alcohol-free. And we got the cherry, and it's a two-pack. And it's an eight ounce in each. Um, it's such a good price at Costco. It's like the only way to get Benadryl of any sort, really. So we did get that. Um, I got more prenatals. Um, these are actually on sale as well. I needed those because I am breastfeeding still. So pick those up. Um, we did get some... Uh, triple action joint health. Um, I don't, <laughs> I don't know. Um, I think we're going to try to take this you guys and just, you know, get a little bit uh, mo more mobility going and all that good stuff. So it is what it is, but I thought we'd try this. Um, I actually, um, hurt my knee a little while back. So I'm just trying to, I've been icing it and everything and trying to do, um, 
a little bit of therapy with it before actually like going in and seeing like what's going on with it. So I don't know if I tore my MCL or what, but um, I was going to go ahead and give this a shot possibly and see if that works or helps. Uh, we did get these kid face masks because they still have to wear masks in class. Um, they don't have to wear them outside where we live, but they do have to wear them inside the classroom. Um, and my son ripped it open because he was so excited. But they have really cool, like, there's tie-dye, and there's 50 masks in here. So it was a pretty good price. He really liked this one. It looks like Minecraft. So that's cool. I think this is like a green, like, army kind of tie-dye looking one. And then red. So we went ahead and got those just to... Um, we got also the adult mask, black ones. Um, I think it's filter or FLTR, uh, face masks. There's 75 in here and this is just for work and to kind of finish up, um, at work you still have to wear masks, so that it is what it is. Um, and these ones are nice, easier to breathe in, especially like there's blue ones, but for some reason they like feel like they're suffocating you, but Anyway, so we did get those, and we we're happy to see that they had them. Um, my husband, we got Breathe Right strips. Um, they're not on sale, but it's still a really exceptional deal for 72 of them. These are the tan strips, and they just work better. They stay on. This is extra strength. So we got those. I was so happy to see that Costco had um, infant Tylenol. Uh, we haven't. I've checked every time I've been there, and I haven't seen it um, for months. So I was really excited. I don't know if I was just missing it or what. Um, I searched pretty well, but, um, I was super excited to see it this time. Such a great deal because if you know, infant Tylenol or Motrin is very expensive. They didn't have infant Motrin, but they had children's Motrin. So I did pick this up. My daughter's been teething like crazy. Um, this just helps every now and then with that. And there's two fluid ounces in each. And this is the cherry flavor, which she prefers over the grape. Um, yeah, so just a great deal. You can't beat the price. Uh, we did get more B12. We're almost out, and this was on sale. We love the Kirkland Signature B12. We've gotten used to the taste, and yeah, we just like this one. Um, I think that's pretty much it here. So I think I got everything. Hopefully I didn't miss anything. My phone, like I said, um, the storage filled up, so I had to take care of that. Um, but I think this is everything. So hopefully I showed you guys everything here and I will show you, um, the dairy. Um, I don't know if there's any dairy, but anyways, I will show you the cold and the frozen, uh, in the kitchen. So, okay, so here is all the cold items. We'll start with the produce. Uh, we got these organic strawberries. Like I said, it is 4th of July weekend. So I'm going to make like a little... Um, you've probably seen it uh, on the internet or on YouTube, but it's just that jello, like that jello dish with Cool Whip and like strawberries and berries. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Um, and then the one thing I need to get is blueberries to do that with. But anyway, so we got organic strawberries. Uh, we did get some green grapes. They looked really good. And these are going to be to snack on and for lunches next week. Um... I did get um, the Caesar salad kit. We really like this Caesar salad kit. It's organic and it's really yummy, really easy. And you can actually just tear up one of their um, rotisserie chickens and throw it in and it makes a really quick, easy meal. Uh, we did get zucchini and squash to, um, and yellow squash to grill. So we're gonna do some, a little bit of grilling. And then um, we did get broccoli for some dinners and celery as well for some dinners and snacking so we did get those and this is organic as well um let's see we got i'm super excited about this you guys um so we were standing there looking at all the ice cream and there's all these new items we have tried these and we absolutely love them um that's why we have more and luckily they were still in stock um but we were standing there and someone was taking a picture of this and I was like, I really want to try this. I told my husband and she's like, they're so good. She goes, it's ridiculous. So this is brown sugar boba ice cream milk bars. There's 12 bars in here. She said it's like ridiculously good. So I'm excited to try that. So we did get that. Lots of summer treats here. Um, 
And then another lady, as we were talking to her about these, she's like, you know what's really good? These are ridiculously good. And she's like, I'm serious. She's like, you have to try them. So they're 110 calories, so not too bad. So that's good. And they're root beer float cream bars. Um, we've had the root beer push-up, uh, like the a, I think it's A&W, um, at Sam's Club in the past. We got them for like spring break. Um, and they were really good, but a lot, it had a lot more sugar. So this is a little bit better, and this is the Alden's Organic, and it's um, organ made. It says root beer float cream bar, and there's 18 in here, and you guys, this is on sale, so it was a really good price. So we got those, and then as well as the um, La Michicana, the mango helada, the little mango cups. These are so, so good and so cute. This would be like really cool for like a birthday party even during the summer. Or like um, if you're having a fiesta or like a barbecue or something, it'd be they're so cute. They're really cool. Um, we did get the Angus ground chuck and beef patties. This is a one third pound. Um, so we went ahead and got these because it is grill season and we've been into barbecuing a little bit. Like at least once um, a week, one night a week. Um, so we did get those. Um, and then... This is our first time trying it. We've been eyeing it for a while. This is the beef bulgogi. So it's like Korean barbecue style meat. And it's in there with the onions and everything. I'm really excited to try this. I'll let you know. I've heard good things. So um, it's a little over three pounds. And it's $6.29 per pound. So actually comparable to like how expensive meat is right now. It's not too bad. So we are going to barbecue this here in the next like sometime this weekend. And I will let you guys know, but we're really excited to try that. Um, we got this mango salsa. This is by the La Mexicana brand. I really like this brand salsa. And this mango salsa is really good. So we did go ahead and get this. It's organic mango salsa. And there's 32 ounces in there. And then we did get the, um, is it Grillo's? Grillo's pickles. Um, I've seen these in a couple of halls and I've seen them from time to time there. And we just never grabbed them to try them, but I'm excited. They're dill spares, so my son loves them. We put them in his lunch, and again, I'm going to say it again, grill season, barbecue, summer season. These are perfect to have, like, a, a fresh little snack, so, or even with your hamburger on the side. And then we did get um, our flat meat. We didn't get it last time because meat, you know, everyone knows it's extremely expensive right now. And even this is, I swear to you guys, it's like another... I don't know, five, six-ish dollars from what we normally spend, or like five-ish dollars. So it's thirteen ninety-nine a pound. Usually we get it. I swear it's like ten ninety-nine or maybe even nine ninety-nine a pound. But um, this is almost three pounds. But yeah, it's pretty pricey. So, um, but we did go ahead and get this as well to probably grill up this weekend because um, we are kind of having like a little stay-at-home Fourth of July. So um, we wanted to do something like kind of nice for our kids. Um, we did get this Columbus um, uh, lunch meat. Uh, this is the herb roasted turkey breast. It is $4 off right now. So such a great deal. We used up all of our um, meat from the last haul that we got. We got the Columbus as well. Um, and when I saw it was $4 off this um, ad, I went ahead and picked that up. So we love that. It's really tasty. And then um, we did get the Panera bread mac and cheese. Um, my older son can eat this like after school, after summer school or whatever. And I think you just heat them up. And then I even thought my one-year-old, she will like this. And it's a little bit more clean ingredients um, versus some of the other mac and cheeses. So um, we went ahead and got that. Hey guys, okay, this is going to be the second part of my haul. It's been a couple of days and... Um, we went back, we actually went to two because I was looking for those big pool floaties, but I couldn't find them. Unfortunately, I should have grabbed them the other day and I forgot and they were sold out. But we did get um, kind of the rest of the stuff we needed for the most part. And of course, a little bit more. So we spent $2.90, I think, $2.89 something or $2.90 something. Um, and so altogether, it's like a, over a $1,200 haul. So um, it's definitely going to be fun to watch. But um, I will just get right into it. And I'm going to also edit the prices in this one as well. So uh, we got bananas. And these are organic ones. 
I got more um, olive oil. Um, I'm almost out of that huge one. Um, and this time I got the, Cal the Kirkland Signature California Extra Virgin Olive Oil. Just because I think it was a, a tad bit cheaper than the other one by a couple dollars. Um, eventually we might switch to avocado oil. I know people are doing that, but I'm just, I'm not there yet. I haven't tried it. And anyways, I really love my olive oil. Um, my younger son wanted these and I thought this would be a good snack for summer school and also for the house. Um, these are the Kirkland Signature Peanut Butter Pretzels. They're really good. We've had them before, just not in a, a while. We also love the ones at Trader Joe's, of course. I did get, we're almost out of like our Kirkland cooking spray, but we did go ahead and switch to the avocado oil on this one. So we will try the spray. Um, I'm sure we won't notice too much of a different taste or anything like that because you don't really notice it anyways. But we're going to start out with this and then eventually we'll switch to the oil for cooking. Um, this was a really fun item. I saw this last time. And I make these myself, and I did for the holidays, so I was kind of hesitant, but they were on sale, like clearance down to $13. I, I'm pretty sure they were more than that last time. Um, I saw them like a month ago or a couple weeks ago. But um, there's 16 chocolate bombs in here, um, and I guess the brand is Bomb Bombs. Um, but uh, we're actually doing like a... Um, Christmas in July little day with my boys with my kids and we're gonna do like kind of starting our Christmas wish list and watch some movies and kind of make our like bucket list for the holidays and so we're gonna do fun things like that I even have a gingerbread house that I have left over from last Christmas from Costco so we're gonna decorate that and just have like a fun Christmas in July day um, once summer school lets out here at the end of the month and then I thought it'd be fun to do some cocoa bombs and then I'll probably freeze the rest for the holidays or store them somehow but um I thought they were just so cool and even though I make them it's nice to have these on hand and I thought it was really neat so definitely check those out at Costco uh, we got tortilla chips a huge bag we love the tortilla strips at um the mission ones at Costco we love that and they last forever it's such a great price we got another rotisserie chicken. We used up the last one to make chicken noodle soup um, with like homemade noodles. This time I think I'm gonna do a chicken pot pie. So I cut up like double the veggies that I made used for the soup and I have it in a Ziploc and then I can easily make a pie. I have some pie crust. So we'll do that for dinner here in the next day or so. Uh, these were on sale. So we got that. I'm trying to do be a little bit better on not getting them this kind of cereal, um, but only get it every once in a while, so they're not having it that much. But there are two bags in there, so it was a good deal, and it's a nice little treat. Uh, I got bell peppers for dinners. And then we did get some Honeycrisp apples. I love Honeycrisp apples. We all do here. They're really, really good. And, like, how cute is this little little tote that it came in and they're not too badly priced some of the apples like there was these huge are they Fuji I can't remember maybe they're Fuji um, they were huge um, but they didn't look that great those were pretty pricey like a whole case of them was pretty it was like 13 or 14 dollars so these weren't as bad and they looked pretty good so we got those um, I got these for the first time it's the Greek pita, the tw there's 12 flatbreads in here. It is white bread, but um, I'm actually gonna freeze them. And then for like an easy lunch or even dinner for my boys, um, I was thinking about doing little pizzas. They can make great little pizza crusts. So I thought about freezing them and we could pull a couple out every now and then for a quick um, lunch or dinner. And then just put some marinara sauce because we always have usually some on hand. And then um, we do have some like toppings and we have um, pepperoni in there and stuff and cheese, of course, so we could easily make little pizzas. I did get, um, we got more Costco hot dogs. I'll show you in a minute. So we got the buns because it's just such a great price and we freeze half of this. 
We did go ahead and get muffins this time. Um, we've been holding off for a while, but um, my son really wanted these for like before summer school. So we got um, blueberry, those looked really good. And then we got the vanilla chocolate chunk, which is really good too. So got those. Um, we got two personal watermelons. They're actually out of watermelon because it is um, right after 4th of July. So we just got two of the personal and hopefully they taste good. And then these guys, you guys, um, so um, the other haul that you just watched prior to this, um, we couldn't find these at that Costco. So we went to a dis different Costco today and there was like five of these hiding on a box, like on a random pallet somewhere. And I looked everywhere. I couldn't find the actual pallet, but I found a box with just like five bags on top of some random like crackers or cookies or something. So I did grab two of them and we'll put one away in our little cupboard um, pantry and we will put one in one of our like containers, you know, so they can eat them now for summer school and all that. These are so ridiculously good and the they're s super simple ingredients and they're just really good and not that bad for you. So, okay. So then now we have, um, we got some of the Kirkland Signature Organic Milk. Um, this is for my daughter transi transitioning her, goodness. Uh, there's three in here, uh, cartons, like half gallons. And um, my boys are drinking it too, just because um, space is an issue and I don't need like 14 milks in my fridge. Um, so it is what it is for right now, but normally I like them to have like 1% or like even fat free, but so we got that. Um, this is new. We got, um, these organic cherry and lemonade good pops. They actually weren't even there the other day at the other Costco we went to. Um, but we saw them today and we we're like, oh yes, we need to get these 35 calories per pop. So it's, um, uh, it says delicious and clean, hundred percent fruit juice, no added sugar. So I will definitely let you know how they are. My boys are going to try these right now after this, after I film this. So, um, they definitely look good. And I think how many is in here? 20. Um, uh, my husband did, we wanted to get these. So just as like a, you know, a guilty pleasure every now and then. So we got the Snicker ice cream bars. Um, we're just kind of enjoying the ice cream clearly, but, um, we will kind of get back on track a little bit and not, you know, but we're just enjoying the summer a little bit. Uh, we did, these are new. These are the Nathan's famous, um, Coney Island pretzel dogs. Um, my younger son loves pretzels and he loves hot dogs. So we we're like, bingo. And, uh, my older son was like, oh, I'll definitely have some of those. So we wanted like an easy snack on hand for lunches or after summer school, they come home hungry. Um, but there's 10 in there. So we will let you know how they are, but these are all beef hot dogs wrapped in a pretzel dough. So um, I like that they're just all beef. Um, I will definitely let you know um, how they are. So that was exciting. Uh, we did get um, the beef dinner franks. We barbecued these the other day and they were so good, you guys. So we got some and they, you know, have a great um, expiration date so they can sit in the fridge for a while until we're ready to grill them and we can even freeze half of this or whatever. Um, there's plenty in there. So really, really good. We don't always get these, just kind of like a summer fling thing we're doing right now. Um, this other, let me kind of move this, and this, and this, there we go. We finally got this, you guys, the Rock Plus. This is the griddle, and on the other side is a grill, it's flat. But um, we thought this would be really nice to have to kind of grill stuff. We've been um, using our barbecue, but we thought this would be really nice to... Um, just do inside and make it easy for like veggies or meat or chicken or whatever. And then on the other side, we thought this would be great. Um, it shows for like pancake, you can do pancakes and all sorts of things. But I thought also for tortillas, it would warm up your tortillas really nicely. So I'm excited for that. And this was actually on sale. So I'm glad I waited. Um, let's see. Uh, just ahead um, to get a head start for back to school, I went ahead and picked up a few things that were on sale. These were on sale. Um, I think they're like $4 off, but I'll put the price in there. Um, these are for my older son for back to school. There's five in there. This is the Champion Elite, so Champion brand. 
and they're boxer briefs. And then how cute are these? I got these for my middle son, my younger, my middle child, my younger son. And these are Calvin Klein underwear boxer briefs for boys. There's six in here. So, and that was a really decent price too. So, and the colors are kind of fun and they're super soft. Um, another pack I got, there's only three in here, but they are the Adidas brand and he is getting older. So we went ahead and got these and they are like really soft, um, quick dry fabric. And these were on sale as well. So we got those. Uh, back to school. This is all going to go into back to school bin and I'm going to do a haul on it um, right before they go back to school. But I just, it's easier to get stuff here and there um, versus like one big chunk of money at once. Um, we did get him, you know, the boys are super into the tall socks. So um, you get two of the gray and two of the black. Um, Adidas. Oh, there's four pairs in there. Oh, there's, oh, psh. Two gray and two black, excuse me. So even better. <laughs> I thought there was only three, so that definitely is more worth it. So we got those and they're super soft. Um, we did get him, this will be more for winter, but I did, I only saw one there and I decided just to grab it and it will be a little bit big on him, but he'll grow into it. But I do like to get like at least one pair of sweatpants and then one pair of pant for back to school shopping, even though it's pretty like warm where we live. You don't need like warm clothes anytime soon, but I just like to have it on hand and get it when we're doing the back to school shopping. But this is a champion and they're joggers. So we did get those for him. And then we did get two pairs of these 32 degree, like cool, um, just regular drawstring shorts. We got gray and black. So um, we'll put that in the bucket as well and nice and simple for back to school. And this at least saves me a little bit of money. I know he's going to want probably a couple brand things or we'll take him to the mall or whatever, but this helps a little bit. So definitely check out Costco for back to school stuff, uh, especially if you have like teenage or preteen boys um, or boys that just wear bigger sizes. That's that's a good place to go. So anyways, thank you so much for watching you guys. Definitely give this video a big thumbs up please um subscribe tag along um love to do costco hauls and all sorts of things like that um and comment down below and let me know um i do want to know what your what day you guys go to costco that's what i was trying to figure out we're trying to figure out a good day and when we should post um our haul so let me know because it does take me a minute to edit sometimes depending but let me know and i'm still trying to figure that all out let me know when you guys would like to see a Costco haul. And also I'd like to know when people like to go or when's a good time. So definitely give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, um, and we'll definitely catch you guys in the next one. Thank you so much. Take care.